So in this video we are exploring one of the biggest natural wonders in the world and it's right here in central Laos, the magical Konglor cave. We are taking the dangerous shortcut that most people don't go because of the very bad road conditions but maybe there is something special about it and we will see why people don't go this way. And basically we're gonna take our motorbike inside the cave on the boat you know we're gonna do a shortcut of the loop you know because uh, it's kind of like a, gonna be a hectic, you know, drive all the way down through the main road. So we decided, you know, we're gonna get the boat, uh, motorbike on the boat, and go, yeah, inside the cave. <laughs> right. So it's uh, Kong Konglor Cave. Let's see. Bang bang. Right. So I'm not sure how they're gonna take, you know, my, I mean the bike. Ah? In a boat because it looks like three high, no? <laughs> Look at this, this pre extreme man. I can't even walk. Wow, the views are already amazing, incredible. I can't believe we're gonna go inside of this mountain, bro. So we are still on our secret mission. Stay, stay tuned, bro, because uh, you definitely have to see what is inside. Now we talking, huh? Beautiful, but I can feel the heat. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> and it's just the beginning. Imagine that. Look at the colors. They're a bit struggling with my motorbike. It's a bit crazy. No, no, no. Yeah. Open <laughs> now. Yes. Okay. Let's go. Yeah. Um, sit here or here? You? Yeah. Ah, yeah. uh, okay, okay. Yeah. 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 Put the bike. Put the bike. Put. Yeah. Okay. Ah, okay, okay. okay. So One, two, three, put. Bye. Okay, okay. going inside the darkness it's sad that you cannot see actually where we're going man it's literally inside the tunnel the darkness here we come and we're going pretty fast actually which i don't mind <laughs> it's pretty sick <laughs> the boat is so thin man you can i mean you have to keep the balance you know because if you if you twist like the whole boat Safety man. Alright, I see the light. Fuck. Whoa. This is a like a theater or something like that. Oh man. This is mad. Captain, drop the anchor. It's <coughs> kind of no echo. Jesus Christ. That's big. And you can see actually they're still dripping. All these, you know. Still drop like dripping drops. Oh, no, that's crazy. It's really impressive. Whoa. I mean the size of this, it's I can't even tell how many feet or meters. I'm just experiencing a very strange feeling. <laughs> Looks like a zombie, man, or you know, dinosaur. Look how human. I mean, they're big, and how how big is these ones? We could spend here probably for next five hours, and <laughs> just you know, just look at this. It's just you know, very high form of creation, man. I mean, you know, it's very different perspective of what we see. In every day's life, you know, in our nature, you know, all trees, leaves, clouds in the sky. And this is next level. This one is so beautiful. It's like on the top, they're still dripping. You know, it's very fresh. You can see, you know, of the color. It's very crystal shiny white, you know, build up like a mushroom. Man, it's insane. It's water, you know, it's water dropping like minerals. It's mad.
I thought uh, this is the end, you know, we finished that cave and we're getting out, but there's a round two. Can you see the, the cliff or what? You see it? Jesus Christ, it's so big. What a formation, you see? On top, like tiny one, <laughs> tiny bit. <laughs> and this like massive rock, you see? And boom, the column of the mineral. I really love it. Probably I'm gonna become a caveman. Uh, this is a caveman project. It's like, who are we? Who made this? I mean, and what's the purpose of all of this? This is mind-blowing stuff. I mean, we live in the, in the city doing our stuff, you know, going to work, watching TV, going for drinks, going out, you know, partying, raving, man. And these guys are just doing their thing. I mean, the light just, you know, they switched off the light and my torch is like barely walking man. It was like, you know, shit my pants for a second. Uh, that's a nice joke, huh? <laughs> Thanks. Maybe it was for purpose, you know, just for, like to give you an experience how actually dark can be. This is it, I want to live in the cave. That's it. This is a proper underground. Yeah, so this is crazy man they have to drag the boat <laughs> actually inside of the darkness in a, like inside of the cave so this is a tiny waterfall <laughs> you see the light oh. Woo <laughs> came out straight from the darkness man I yeah, think I'm a different human now yeah, It is, yeah, this is what I, what, what I was thinking Outside world it didn't exist when you're inside the earth you know it's like yeah. fuck you're in darkness and you realize there is no light anytime Wow and I, I appreciate the sun now so much oh, wow. right. Not just for fun but just for your mental health as well man It does something with your mental state in it <laughs> take my shark out I mean we decided that we're gonna take our motorbike you know to the boat to make a shortcut where is it like go through the cave to make a shortcut go oh, back okay. to Muang no Nakai village right this road wasn't on the map yeah and like we, we read some blogs you know and it says this road is very bad like extremely bad condition we're gonna save up some time on the main road just hectic man it's like all 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 the truck drivers you know busy roads <laughs> Even more fun, you know, I mean, this is the reason why why we did it Because this is the countryside, you know, it's like the shortcut This is pretty cool, man, you're on your road Very quiet Yeah, now we're talking, now we're talking. Oh, 
Da, stia sa fac oare, fuck Are bike is glitching, bro You don't even know what to say Yeah, around the corner. <laughs> We're nearly done. Uh, 